Hello everyone, I am Gauri Krishna Rajesh, TGT, Atomic Energy Central School No. 4, Mumbai. Today we will see the demonstration of the experiment showing carbon dioxide is evolved during respiration. What is respiration? Respiration is a biochemical process in which an organic substrate, mainly glucose, is broken down to produce carbon dioxide and energy. Along with glucose and energy, water is also produced during aerobic respiration. Let us see the materials required for the experiment. Here, I am going to display all the materials which are required for this experiment. We need Known green germinated seeds. Here I have taken seeds of pulse called mudki. Its scientific name is Vigna aconitifolia. Freshly prepared potassium hydroxide solution. Conical flask to put germinating seeds. Bent tube inserted into the hole of the cork. Freshly prepared lime water. A colored solution is taken in a beaker to see the rising of the liquid clearly. A small test tube tied with thread to pour KOH. Vaseline to airtight the apparatus. These are the materials required. Now the procedure. I will explain the procedure, how to set up the apparatus. Put the germinating seeds into the conical flask. Add few drops of water to moisten it. Take the small test tube and pour KOH solution into the test tube with a dropper. Use a dropper always. Now we have poured enough KOH solution into the test tube. Now suspend the test tube in the, into the conical flask. Insert the cork with bent tube into the mouth of the conical flask. The other end of the bent tube should be immersed into the colored solution. Apply Vaseline or petroleum jelly to make it airtight. Especially where the cork is inserted and also around the holes so that no air will be entering the conical flask. Now 
now the apparatus is completely airtight and the other end of the vent tube is completely immersed in the colored solution which is taken in the beaker now mark the initial level of the colored solution in the vent tube with a marker you can see the blue mark of the initial level keep the apparatus for some few hours it takes some time for the seeds to respire and use up the oxygen in the flask and the vent tube after 2 hours we can see the red solution has rose up to few centimeters in the vent tube you can mark the final level also why did the liquid rise in the vent tube think about it when potassium hydroxide solution absorbs carbon dioxide released during respiration it creates a vacuum and causes a pressure difference in the colloidal flask this causes the rising of red colored solution into the tube now we have to confirm the gas evolved during respiration is carbon dioxide or not similar setup with non green seeds in the conical flask is taken it is made air tight by using vaselin the cork with vent tube is also introduced but you can see that no test tube with kvh is suspended here we have removed that test tube which was containing potassium hydroxide solution because we don't want to want that carbon dioxide to be absorbed here insert the other end of the vent tube into freshly prepared lime water you can see the lime water inside another small conical flask cover the lime water so that no air enters into the into it here i have covered it with an aluminum foil so that no air will enter into the conical flask only the air from the vent tube will be entering into the freshly prepared lime water keep the setup undisturbed for few hours after 2 hours you can observe 
the lime water turns slightly milky. But observe that no effervescence is produced which is usually the case in which chemical reactions which produce carbon dioxide. Observe clearly the milky color of lime water. The reaction that happens here is lime water that is calcium hydroxide reacts with carbon dioxide to form insoluble calcium carbonate and water. This calcium carbonate is responsible for the milky appearance of the clear solution. So here we conclude the experiment by showing that germinating seeds produce carbon dioxide during respiration. Now here some critical thinking questions are there for you. Discuss this with your teacher. Thank you.